All right, folks, this is how we're going to make uh, a nice roast turn into prime rib. This is a beef sirloin tip roast, and it's about two and a half pounds. It's nice and thick. Um, it's at room temperature right now. I let it sit out for a good two hours. Uh, it's still got a little chill to it. You know, it's not warm, but uh, it's not fresh out of the out of the refrigerator. What I'll do is I'll start off by taking a little, little lorries, sprinkle it, eh, just lightly over the top, rub it in, then uh, put a pretty thick layer of Montreal steak on top as well. I put uh, just a splash, I mean about a teaspoon of water, half on one side, half on the other. You don't want to broil it, you just want a little moisture in there. Uh, the oven will get preheated to 500. Once it's preheated, I put the the pan in, and then I let it I let it stay in there at 500. Actually, once it's in, I, I bring the heat down to 425. So it's preheated at 500. Once the meat goes in, drop the heat to 425, and then it's six minutes per pound. So this is two and a half pounds. It'll be about 20 minutes. Then I turn the oven totally off and I let it sit for two hours. Do not open the oven. You can turn the light on and look at it, but that's it. So after two hours um, of sitting, it'll it'll permeate nice. You'll have you'll have a nice pink middle, and the outside will be nice and dark. And I guarantee it tastes like prime rib. It's really good stuff. I, I make this probably more often than I should. Um, everything in moderation but uh, this will give me a nice dinner and a bunch of sandwiches for the next couple days so that's where we're at right now being that this roast was a little bit thicker than most of them. I went a little bit longer um, instead of 18 minutes I went with 20 and um, that's where I'm at right now so turn it off set the timer hours and that's when I'll be eating well actually when I take it out I let it rest for about five minutes on the cupboard before I cut it but uh, there we go and here we are at the bottom of the two hours and let's see what we got here That's how it looks. The light's kind of messing with it. It looks a little bit darker in real life. Um, let's see if I can set the camera down. And cut into the thickest part. Let's see how it looks. And that's done. Perfect. Perfectly perfect. That's how it looks. Not ra not raw. It's just perfectly rare. Bust apart nice, nice and juicy. And that's the thickest part right there. So I'm gonna go eat. And uh, if you do uh, make this recipe, uh, post it to the video and let me know how you enjoyed it. I'm hungry and. See you later.